Oxford in Nigeria Pitch Awards. Uh, yesterday, there was a, a news conference in Abuja here about the 10th edition. Uh, a couple of um, um, months ago, in June actually, the 10th edition aired in Uyo, uh, Akwaibom State. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, yeah. these are pictures from that 10th uh, edition uh, where we had the likes of um, uh, Ojo Olorun Leke being voted the goalkeeper of the year. Ola Ino won the defender of the year. Alex Wobi was voted the mid midfielder of the year. Victor Osime was voted the striker of the year. Aziz Atoshola was voted the queen of the pitch. Uh, Osime, king of the pitch. Team of the year was Eimba. Then coach of the year was Finidi George. Then the football pitch of the year went to the Gosu Lakpabio International Stadium in Uyo. Uh, so, uh, the organizers of the Nigeria Pitch Award, in conjunction with the Nigeria Football Federation, uh, what they are trying to do, of course, is to promote uh, football excellence in the country, celebrate the country's uh, best male and female footballers. Uh, so, uh, the, the awards are presented to Nigerian former and present sports people, administrators, uh, of course, and journalists in recognition of their positive contributions to sports in Nigeria. And the NFF is fully in support. The first edition uh, aired on November 16, 2013 in Calabar, Cross River State. And they've sustained it till now. So you look at uh, various categories like the uh, striker of the year, goalkeeper of the year, defender of the year, midfielder of the year, uh, club of the year, manager of the year, journalist of the year. And they're also trying to see how to uh, bring in more categories in the coming days. Let's take a listen now to uh, the president of the Nigeria Pitch Awards, Mr. Shino Phillips. And we also take a listen to the director of communications at the Nigeria Football Federation, Mr. Ola, uh, Ademola Olajire, speaking at that news conference in Abuja yesterday. From inception, our intention was to create an award platform that has a unique character of its own a character molded by our core values of transparency, credibility, and integrity. To achieve this, we have followed a carefully laid out award process, which brings together a college of voters comprising some of Nigeria's most knowledgeable, experienced, and professional sports journalists and independent coalition body, and independent, and, and, and independent coalition body. I would like to state that as organizers, we are very proud of and deeply appreciative of our College of Voters, which includes many of you present in this hall. We owe it to you that in the last 10 years of the Nigeria Peach Awards, none of our award decisions have been controversial. And I can state clearly that for all editions, for all the winners, we have remained incontrovertible. We have stayed firm and prestigious. The award process is designed to be sustained in such a way that it can become a generation's legacy to our children. We are delighted that the Nigeria Beach Award has come to stay and is now an, an integral part of our annual football calendar and culture. As we have often stated, this is part of our contribution to the growth of our football. It is an award platform which serves to encourage, inspire, and motivate our footballers and stakeholders. As you would have observed, whether our footballers win or lose a game, the Nigeria Peach Awards will always be, host, be hosted both to celebrate our footballers' commitment and to encourage them to higher levels of commitment in future. Our determination to continue to host the Anna Award is a demonstration of our faith in the future of our football in Nigeria. We are convinced that this will equally encourage corporate Nigeria to join us as we work to us, as we work to advance the fortunes of our Nigerian football and footballers. So one thing that has kept uh, you know, the NFF giving support to this particular project is the transparency, the accountability, you know, and the integrity and credibility of the process all along, all along. I can attest to that, you know, the work that SIAO partners has been doing, you know, it's wonderful. And the fact that there's just one, uh, you know, uniform college of voters, you know, each uh, one year, year in, year out, and there's never been any controversy about it, you know, and uh, they, they've really uh, gone through a lot. But I am very happy, you know, where the Peach Awards is, 
the last awards, the, the last ceremony in uh, Uyo, uh, during the, the match uh, in June, early June, you know, the NFL presidents and the general secretary were all there, and of course, all the players of the Super Eagles. You know, that's a test to you know, the confidence that the NFL retains in the awards, you know, because of the way they have been going about it.